Hey guys, today I have a product review for you guys and it's going to be on London Ivy products. If you haven't heard of London Ivy products, it's because maybe it's a smaller brand and it's a Canadian brand as well. So I'm really excited to introduce to you London Ivy products. I met Monique, the owner of London Ivy products at the New Orleans Hair Expo this past summer and she was amazing, an amazing lady eccentric style. I love her so much. She's so cool and uh, down to earth. So she asked me if I wanted to review her products. So I agreed to review the products honestly and that's what I'm going to do today. So the first product that I'm going to be reviewing is the Sweet Cocoa Shea by London Ivy Products and it is a rich hair and body butter. It's made with natural and organic ingredients and it includes shea butter, cocoa butter, a whole oil and a whole bunch of other great ingredients as well. All natural and really, really good ingredients, very oil rich. It says the fragrance is a sweet orange smell and that's what I get whenever I smell this product. It's a really um, sweet orange citrus smell and it smells really, really good. The consistency is really, really buttery um, upon like whenever I first dig into it, it's really whipped. Um, but whenever I rub it into my fingers and my skin and my hair, it's really, really buttery and velvety and smooth. I really like it. In fact, that's what I use in my hair today to achieve this twist out. Only using London Ivy products. This is one of the products and another product that I use, which I will review in a little while for you guys. But I love it. My hair is movable and it has hold. I only uh, I used it on, um, my hair was already in a twist out, but I used it with a little bit of uh, steam from the Q-Redo, and then I twisted it with two London Ivy products. So it says it's good for twist outs, braid outs, locks, etc. Use on damp skin if you're gonna use it on your body. Um, I haven't really used it on my body yet, but um, I'm sure it's really good. I don't care for butters on my body, but I do love them in my hair because I get the most out of my twist outs. I get stretch, I get shine, I get the, the fluffiness, I love it. The next product is called Smooth Operator. It's a luxe pomade. It has castor oil, rice bran oil, and beeswax. It's mineral oil free, petroleum free, paraben free, cruelty free, no synthetic colorants, and no preservatives. You can use it for your hands, feet, and body. Um, it has a lemongrass smell to it. I can tell you that already. Like right off the top, I smell the lemongrass. I love this product for my edges, first of all. Amazing, amazing, amazing shine, no joke. I have it in my hair actually right now. I did my twist out with the shea, and then I also use a smooth operator on my edges and on the ends of my hair for extra shine. It really, really delivers in the shine department and hold. It has um, beeswax and castor oil, so it's really, really good for your edges to regrow them and to just use in your hair in general. It's really awesome. Uh, you could also use this on your heels, it says, to apply to wash heels and seal in moisture. So this is really good for your feet as well. The next product that I'm gonna review from London Ivy Products is the Babasu Honey. It's a deep conditioner. I really, really, really wanted to like this product. Um, I really did, but unfortunately it just didn't deliver um, for me, what I look for in deep conditioners is lots and lots of slip and lots of moisture and pretty much I like a heavy texture whenever it comes to um, deep conditioners because it really uh, saturates my hair. It just did not give me any kind of slip. I have no idea why it didn't give me any slip, but it just didn't give me any slip. It wasn't thick in texture. It was actually kind of horrible as you can tell um, from what I showed you. And um, it just did not let me detangle my hair. I have no idea why. I really wanted to love this product and that's one of the products that I chose to review and I was so excited about it because um, they actually have good reviews on the website and I was like, it just didn't, it didn't deliver for me. I don't know why, I have no idea, but it smells good. And um, you know, it might work for finer hair textures or coarser hair textures. It just didn't work for mine. Everybody's hair is different. Um, but needless to say, it does have natural organic ingredients like babasu oil, honey, broccoli seed oil, really good stuff. Um, it's paraben free, mineral oil free, gluten free, cruelty free, no synthetic colorants, vegan. Um, and yes, you use it as a deep conditioner. So I just wanted to like it and I just didn't, honestly. Now the next products that I'm gonna be reviewing are um, skin products from London Ivy products. The first one is Rejuvenating and Nourishing Face Serum. To be honest with you, I didn't know how I was gonna feel about this product. Um, whenever I first got it, you know, I had chosen it on the website and I was like, ooh, that sounds really cool. But whenever I first got it, I was like, it's an oil. That's all, it's an oil. It's not gonna, it's gonna break me out because I have oily skin. And I just instantly wanted to start writing it off, but let me tell you how amazing this product is. It's crazy because after I um, wash my face, I go ahead and I mist some toner on my face. 
and then I put the rejuvenating um, serum on my face and it's like a cooling sensation that it gives my face. Not too much, it's just kind of like this cooling, um, refreshing feeling that it gives to my face and it's an oil so I just instantly thought it was going to be really shiny and really oily but it's actually the opposite. It's pretty matte and it's velvety. It has this really good texture to it and just my skin drinks it up and it dissolves right into my skin and it doesn't make my skin too oily or anything like that. I love it because I have acne prone, oily skin. Like that's just how my skin is. Um, but it really improved my skin, the, the texture of my skin. It just got smoother over time. I've been using it for maybe almost two months now and I really, really do love the benefits. I see my skin getting better. It's pretty clear. Okay, and I, and I know I have makeup on, but it doesn't really do it any justice. Um, but it has organic and natural ingredients like rose hip oil, it has safflo uh, safflower oil, jojoba oil, macadamia oil, um, rice bran oil. So you just go ahead and put two pumps and apply it to your face and your neck overnight and I promise you, you will see a difference in your skin. I love it. It's definitely, look, and it definitely lasts a long time because I've been using it for two months and I'm right here with it. So um, two pumps goes a long, long, long way. I have a ton left and I, I use it every single night for two months. The next product is called Musk and it is a product for men. Um, but you know, it, it's pretty, I mean, it's not for men. It's designed, it's geared towards men, I guess because of the smell and because of the, um, of what it's used for. But it has bergamot and cedar wood. It's an aftershave and toner. It has um, rosehip oil, witch hazel, which is a really good toner for the skin. Rose water, which is another really good toner for the skin. So yeah, it's used to, it, you have to shake it really, really well because it does have oils in it um, because it settles. And let's see, it says, after cleansing and shaving, just apply the toner directly. It is a spray. Um, and just walk right into it. Okay, so after I wash my face, I apply musk to my face and you can just instantly, it's really refreshing, and you can instantly feel your skin just start to um, kind of tighten a little bit because of the astringent properties and in the ingredients. Really, really good. I love, love, love musk and the smell is so amazing. I'm a woodsy type of person. I love woodsy musky smells. I'm not into floral or anything like that. And this really does have an amazing smell. Um, so yeah, I was supposed to originally give this to my cousin Cedric because he met me, um, he met Monique as well at the Natural Hair Expo and I just never got a chance to run into him again and he was supposed to review it but I'm doing it for you Cedric, there you go, I am going to give you your products whenever, hopefully it's not all out whenever I give it to you but yeah, it's awesome, I love it, love it, love it and I also spray it on my um, legs whenever I'm done shaving as well and I love it. So the last product from London Ivy is going to be, um, and Really, I really don't know how to say this, but it's Cup of Chew Shea, okay? And it's a lip balm. I first got, uh, whenever I first apply it to my lips, it's kind of like grainy in a way. It has a grainy texture and then it just melts into your lips. Like it's awesome. It's literally like butter. It's really actually like butter you use to bake. You put it on your lips and it just melts and it's shiny. I love, love, love it. And it's smooth and it's thick and not thick to um, where it's like sticky, but it's thick and it just stays on my lips. Literally, I love it, love it. I've been actually keeping it in my purse and I use it throughout the day. Um, so yeah, that is the lip balm, okay? And it has olive oil, shea butter, beeswax, um, all natural and organic ingredients. The last product that I have to review for you guys is a product that everybody's been really inquiring about ever since I posted a picture on Instagram. I'll go ahead and insert that right now because a lot of people have been asking me about it. It is the scarf. Um, it's an African hair scarf, okay? It is so beautiful. Look at the print. Amazing, okay? And it's really, really thick and it's actually a real African head scarf, okay? So um, it's really, really long, maybe like the size of, actually, it's actually taller than me. So I just, I just stood against it and it's taller than me. It's a um, long scarf, it's kind of rectangular, it's not square, and I love it. The Just the feel and the texture of it, it's really sturdy and you can tell it's handmade. I love this scarf. Really vibrant colors, I really do love the colors in it, and like I said, the texture is amazing. This is the ends. Um, of the scarf and I really do love it. I'll actually uh, 
to preserve my twist outs or my braid outs and to go out during the day if I have a twist out I just go ahead put a satin bonnet on top on top of my hair and then I go ahead and wrap the scarf um, like you saw in the picture and I just go about my day because I love it love it so um if you're interested in London Ivy products I'll leave all the information on London Ivy products in the description box below so be sure to check it out guys go ahead check them out support them they're really really awesome um really great ingredients I really do love this product line um the only thing that i really didn't like was the babasu honey deep conditioner but hey not everything works for everybody just go ahead and check them out and if you like this video go ahead give it a thumbs up comment rate subscribe show some love and go ahead and just follow me on instagram ashley and williams underscore i hope you guys enjoyed thanks so much for watching 